Hello, I would like to welcome you to this little chapel here in France, in Normandy, at Auto Saint Sulpice, the chaplaincy of Saint Mary of the Virgin, which is under the jurisdiction of the Diocese of the United Kingdom of the Anglican Catholic Church, the original province. My bishop is, uh, is Bishop Damien Mead, who is based in southern England. So this chapel is part of his diocese. The particularity of this chapel is that I use the, the use of serum for the Mass and various other offices. Uh, this chapel is not uh, generally frequented by many people, but is rather in the optic of like a monastery chapel where the important thing is to offer the sacrifice of the Mass and the office in intercession for the Church. In the second video of this short series, I'm going to make an introduction to the actual celebration of um, low Mass according to the use of sermon. We will now go to the sacristy and I'll show you the various uh, things that are involved. So we go through into this very, very tiny sacristy. I'll just point the camera towards the, the vestment press. Take a little bit of distance so that it can be seen. Now then, the chalice is prepared uh, in exactly as in Roman rite, a chalice with a purificator, the pattern, and I keep my host in here. Host, pull, chalice veil. And the pole. The bus, rather. So, uh, after preparing uh, the the um, material things, I put on an amis, an alb, and a cincture. I recite the hymn Veni Creator Spiritus which ends with the verse, Sit laus palfi cum filio, sancto simul peraclito, novisque emitted filius, charisma sancti spiritus, amen. Then I put on the, the maniple, the stole, and the chasuble. And then I recite the prayer, Emiti spiritum tuum et creabuntu et renovabis facium terre, oremus, Deus qui omnico patit et omnis voluntas locuto et quen nullum latis secretum, purifica vivisim in sancti spiritus cogitationis verbis cordis nostri, ut perfectiti felicio et digni radare mariamo, per dominum nostrum Jesu Christum filium tuum, et qui tecum vivit et regnatim in tati spiritus sancti Deus, per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. Which is the Latin version, of course, of the more familiar prayer, which is known to Anglicans as the collect of purity, Almighty God, unto whom all hearts be open, all desires known, and for whom a secret are hid, etc. After that, the priest then leaves the sacristy fully vested and comes under the root screen So at this point here, the root screen is up here. There's the rood, which is presently covered, which is presently veiled for Lent, and the statues, the, the big crucifix. And so I lower the microphone again, and the priest in this chapel here stands at this point to recite the Incrude Bell Day. 
and the psalm Utica May. At the end of which he says the Gloria Patri. And uh, uh, the antiphon as he approaches the altar. We're now going to approach the altar. So I'll bring the camera and the computer up here. Let me put it all here. There should be good visibility here. There we are. I should be able to see most of what I do at the altar. So this is not a real mass. This is just a dry run uh, for the purpose of instruction. So this is why I'm not wearing the vestments. Um, I'm going to put the everything on here. I use a very, a very convenient arrangement here. I have a little booklet which I've made with the use of serum, which is uh, presented like this. Yeah, and this is the Dickinson edition of the serum missile, uh, which was published in the 19th century. And this is a modern reproduction, marked here for Friday, end of Friday of Lent. So, as the priest approaches the altar after having said uh, the Utica May psalm, he very bows as he repeats the antiphon, in three God our day, a day in qualificat human to Tomeum. Approaches the altar, puts the chalice down here, opens the verse, and puts out the corporal, just like in the Roman Rite. Now, the difference is, the chalice is unveiled, when the thing here is taken down, put the corporal here in its place. Now, the cruet's not here, but they would be here at a real mass. So I'll pretend to take the cruets. I pour in wine into the chalice, and then I recite the prayer, Ad Eus et Benedicta, de curus latere exhibit sanguis et aqua, in omni pathos et fidi et spiritus sancti, over the water. Take the water cruet, put in a little drop. And now I put a baton to the host, the pool, I leave the pool, and I leave the purificator to one side. Recover everything. Make a little bow, turn round, and make a profound bow at the foot of the altar. I'll turn the camera just a little bit. The Paternoster, the Alpha Maria, and the last two versicles of the Paternoster, et nemos in Lucas in tentationum, sed libera nos amalo. Confitemi domine coenum bonus, coenum in seculum misericordia ebus. The confitio is recited whilst bowing. The miseria auto nostra in Lucas Deus, bibitit on the peccata nostra, libera nos abominalo, conservative confirmat in bono, et utitum et duca fidelum. Amen. Absolutum et remissionum in omnum peccator nostrum, spatium vero penitentiae te mendatium vitae, gratum et consolatium in sancti spiritus, trebuat nobis omnipotentit misericordia dominus. Amen. Adjutorium nostrum in omni domini, quifricit cerum et terram, 
Sit now and down in the Benedictum, et hoc no cudus quen sectum, oremus. Alpha and the discussion is coming to come to the new cadet of Nostros, who is the sanctus sanctorum purus maniam in et esus in fere, victus dum domin nostrum, amen. There's only one single prayer in the use of serum rather than two in the Roman rite. The priest then makes the sign of the cross, in omni patris et fili et spiritus sancti, amen. Moves over to the Missal, reads the introit, like in the Roman Rite. Just going to move the camera so that I can be seen. There we are, that's just right. Uh, inclination towards the cross of the Gloria Patri. Repeats the, the introit, or the officium, as it's called in the use of serum stays in this position at the altar as he says Kyrie eleison three times, Christi eleison three times, Kyrie eleison three times. Now in the Roman rites the priest would now go to the centre of the altar, kiss the altar and say Dominus Rubiscum. In the use of the serum we stay, the priest stays where he is and turns like this Dominus Rubiscum Ed cum spiritu tuo, oremus, as it's lent, flectamus genua, levate. Says the prayer, Per Dominum nostrum Jesu Christum filium tuum, qui tecum vivit et regnatum in stati spiritu sancti Deus, per omnia saecula saeculorum. Amen. Lectio Ezequielis Prophete. This is the, the lesson, which is usually an epistle, but uh, in these Lenten periods, it's, uh, they tend to be Old Testament readings, which is followed by the gradual, and the tract, which is Domine Non Secundum, uh, which is on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays of Lent. Otherwise, the uh, Gradual is said, the verse of the gradual, and then the gradual is repeated when there is no tract, as on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays, and of course Sundays, uh, uh, of course the Sunday has its own tract. So, I flip the missal, as one said in old medieval usage. Then the priest says the prayer, You be done with the benediction, no one sits in court in merit and happy space, at pronuncian and sanctum aventium in day, in nomine patris et fili et spiritus sancti. Amen. Dominus from this one, et cum spiritu tuo, sequentia sancti evangelii, secundum nonem, gloria tibi domine. In illo tempore, recite the gospel all the way to the end. There is no little phrase at the end of the Gospel and there is no rounds to be Christi. Simply the priest bows down and kisses the Gospel without saying anything. Moves the book over to the center of the altar. If it's a Sunday Mass there is the Credo in Unum Deum. Uh, at other Masses uh, there's just a simple bell to the altar, no kissing of the altar like in the Roman Rite. Turns, Dominus Rubiscum, et cum spiritu tuo. Oremus, reads the operatory verse. And now uncovers the chalice. Takes off the pole, but leaves the, pat the pattern on top of the, on the chalice. Lifts the two and says, Suchipe Sancta Trinita Sancta Gratium Quantibio Carinus Pucaratu, Operate in order to Gatinare Tonibus Sanctorum at Warum for Pacatus Aventio in this way, said Pusuluti before much play between. Ad quae omnium fidium de punctorum. 
Y no me pasa que se pide el Espíritu Santo que haya principio en el tiempo de hoy, o que se pide un nuevo. Pese de Charles, the host, and puts the pattern halfway under the corporal, but doesn't cover the, the, uh, the, the pattern. This is in common with the Dominican Rite. And it was the Dominican Rite that enabled me to clarify this aspect of the serum use. Couple of the chalice. Now it goes to the credence. Turn the camera towards the credence. There we are. And Mundabe Domina Bobni Inquinamenta Metis Corpus of Possim Proof. I've forgotten the prayer because it's completely out of context. Okay. Turn the, micro, turn the camera back to the altar. Mm. Yes, yes. Back to the altar. So the priest moved back from the creams back to the altar and reads the prayer in spiritual humilitati sitting in our completo, which is almost the same as in the Roman Rite, except for a tiny difference of syntax. Kisses the altar. Tzitzinatum, ordinatum, et sanctificatum, hoc sacrificium nostrum, in omni patris, et fini, et spiritus sancti. Amen. Turns, orati fratres, Et sorores pro me, ut me in clarity qui vestum acceptum, sit on your de nostro sacrificium. If there is a server, he responds, otherwise the priest responds for himself. Oremus, unlike in the Roman Rite, there is Oremus, like in the Dominican Rite, like in most of the Northern French usages. Says the secret prayer, I always say the secret, secret prayer aloud. Per Domino Nostri Mies and Christum Funium Tom, qui take in period to bring out in unitate spirit of Sancti Deus, per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. Here I remove the missal and I have my little uh, booklet, which is a lot more practical for use at the altar. The introduction to the preface is exactly as in the Roman Rite. Per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. Dominus obiscum et cum spiritu tuo. Susum corda habemus ad dominum. Gratis ad dominus domine de nostro. Dinium et justum est. Veri dinium et justum est. The sanctus with the arms crossed. This is a particularity of serum. Uh, bowing. And then with the sign of the cross. Benedictus qui uh, venit in nomine domini. Then turns to the canon, page to a clementis in the part of the years of Christian feeling to and on in Nostrum Sixtum This is all said as in the Roman Rite with signs of the cross. Momentum Domine Famon Pan Quatuarum, praise for the intention of the Mass, for the living, as in the Roman Rite. Communicantes of Memorum Venerantes. Uh, Sempre Virgin et Maria, Gems, Fitches, Dei, Domini Nostri, Jesu Christi, as in the Roman Rite. Verendum Christum Domini Nostrum, Amen. Unlike in the Roman Rite, the Roman Rite, the priest would impose hands like this for the handkerchief to draw. In the use of serum, we continue like this. Handkerchief to draw, oblationum, per Christum Domini Nostrum, Amen. Quam abrationum to Deus in omnibus creation of benedictum. Three signs of the cross. Corpus et sanguis de delictissimi. The consecration is, the words are exactly the same. Qui pregi quam pantheretur, a chepit pan in sanctus et vernabilis manus tuas, et elevatis opus in cerum ad idiom patum sumum potentem, tibi gratis arginis, Benedicit, pregit, 
did it with the shepherds with the chains. And then says the words of institution over the host. Makes a profound bow and elevates the host. Replaces it on the corporal with the sign of the cross. There is no second bow and there is no genuflection. Uncovers the chalice, wraps the sands and fingers, and similar motive was quenching out an est, blesses the chalice, and uh, then says the words of institution over the chalice. In remission and peccatorum, take cotis cum precocitis in me memoriam facitis. Replaces the chalice on the altar, covers, turns the page, no bow or genuflection. Now puts out the, his arms in the form of the cross for the undead memories. Brings the arms in again at Orphanimus proclaimed as static tree, the two is done as gratis, hostium purum, etc. Supra que propitio. For the circuitous terigamus, the arms are crossed over the chest. Priest bows. Supplicates the regalus on the ten deus, you be had the third and non sentient to each of the streets of the girls, the item of the third and the third and the three. Would walk with ex acadais by the platinum, sacrosanct of the three. Corpus et sanguum sum serums on the benediction of celeste gratia rectiamo. Per Christum, per rundum Christum Domini nostrum. Amen. Memento etium Domini. The prayer for the departed. For the intentions of the Mass, for the priest's own intentions. Ipsis Domine. Perante Christum Domine Nostrum Amen. Nobis quoque peccatoribus, as in the Roman Rite, continues this prayer for Christum Domine Nostrum. Perquem heco ne Domine semper con ne creas, sanctificas, rubricas, benedicis expressis nobis. Well, this is very particular. Peripsum et cum ipso et in ipso es divideo patrum dividenti in mentati spiritus sancti. No elevation. Omnis on et gloria, profound bow. Peronia secula seculorum, amen. No bow or genuflection. Orimus. Projectus Salutaribus Moniti, Paternoster Pies in Chilis. After this, at the Libera, the rubrics of the, uh, the ceremonies are completely uh, different from the Roman Rite. I'll do it in full. Libera nos quesimus domine ab omnibus malus presentibus presentibus et cultores, et intelligenti viata de glorius et semper pura regium de agent rich maria. Cum viatis apostolis tuus petuit paulet per hoc non de sanctis. Da propitius pacem in diebus nostris, tobi misericordia tui ebi, tibiticatus sanctus sempre liberi, et ab omnibata baptim seculi. Perendum Dominum nostrum Jesum Christum filium tuum, cui tecum vivit et veniat in unitatis spiritus sancti deibus, Per omnia saecula saeculorum. Amen. Pax Domini sit semper vobiscum et conspiritu tuum. At this point now he says the Agnus Dei, holding the two large parts of the host over the chalice with the left hand and the small part with the right hand over the chalice. Uh, when he's finished the Agnus Dei, he says the prayer, Ex sacrosancti promitio corpus de sanguis domini nostri Jesu Christi, fiat mihi omnibus quae sementibus salus mensit corpus et revitim terum, proclantum et capisendit per fratus solitaris, per Christum domini nostrum. Amen. Covers the chalice and now says the domini sancti patrum omnipotente terni deus domini of sacrosancti corpus de sanguin fidi tui, etc. Then uncovers the chalice. Kisses the altar and kisses the 
tell us if there is a server he will then give that server the peace by saying Pax TV et Ecclesia Dei and the server will respond et conspiratu tuo. The same goes of course at high mass for the deacon. Turns the page, covers the chalice. Now this is another particularity with Seron. The host is taken here with both hands and I hold the pattern with the middle fingers of both hands and say all the pre uh, the pre communion prayers. And they was part of Ponte Dolabutus Bonitatis. The second prayer is said looking devoutly at the host. Te adoro, te glorifico, te tutumentis et cordis intention of the et preco ut nos famos tuus non deseras. Domini Jesu Christi, fili dei vivi, corporis et sanguis tui Domini Jesu Christi. And then there are the communion prayers of the priest. Avi eternum sanctus macaro Christi, miki unto omnia super omnia lucedo, corpus Domini Jesu Christi, sit miki peccatore fiat vita, in nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Takes communion. Of course, in this video, this is not a consecrated host. Uh, I'm not actually celebrating Mass. Take the host. Uncover the chalice. And uh, this is. Uh, this is something that's not clear in the rubrics of the serum use, but I always do. I clean the corporal with the pattern and make sure that all the fragments go into the chalice. I've been eternal to rest his potus, meeting unto omnis with honorary shadow. Corpus is sanguis dominus must be used with the present meeky peccatorum to make him sent eternum, meeting eternum. Amen. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. I then communicate uh, with the precious blood. Now, there's a thanksgiving prayer, which is not present in the Roman Rite, which was somewhat uh, rewritten by Thomas Cranmer for the thanksgiving prayer in the prayer book. Uh, Rite of Mass. Uh, in the use of serum, this, this Thanksgiving prayer is set here. Gratis tibiadu Domini Sancti Patrum Omnipotente Ten Deus, etc. After which, I take the wine cruet, which is pretend. Quodo esum sumus Domini Puramenti Capiam, set in the item prior to Fiat Novus Remedium Sanctorum. Amen. Create the first ablution and then uh, take nos communa domine pos de crinide, wine, water, and then take the purificator chalice. Bring the second ablution and then now usually a serum indicates that the child should be left like this until everything drips out and I'm not really clear what is done with any um, with any liquid that is left over so I usually don't do this I take the purificator and wipe the chalice like in the Roman Rite. And then everything goes back together again as in the Roman Rite. Everything goes together. Okay. 
And then there's a little prayer uh, in the use of serum. Adoremus Gucisinapum Peclotuitisusum Sacramento. And then opens the missal at the proper of the day. Moves the missal over. Another particularity in the use of serum is the priest then rinses his fingers at the sacral room, rather like a, a bishop does at low mass in the Roman rite. Returns to the altar, says the communion, Dominus Fabiscum et conspiritu tuo. Oremus, says the post communion prayer, Per Domino Nostri Miesum Christum Filium Tuum, qui tecum vivit et regnat in unitate spiritus sancti Deus, per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. In the prayer over the people in Lent, Oremus, Flectam, the Humilate Capita Vestra Deo. Then says the prayer over the people, Per Domino Nostri Miesum Christum Filium Tuum, qui tecum vivit et regnat in unitate spiritus sancti Deus, per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. Dominus Fabiscum et cum spiritu tuo. If there is a glory at Mass, the item is as the said in this position. When there is no glory at Mass, as in the case in the use of serum between Septuagesima and the Paschal Vigil of Holy Saturday, the, uh, it is always really become as Domino. Followed by the Bradshaw TV, facing of the altar. In the use of serum, only the bishop gives a blessing. The priest simply signs himself and says, In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Then takes the chalice, will bow, moves here to the foot of the altar, makes a profound bow, and recesses, saying, In bridge, who erit verbum, et verbum, et verbum, et deus erit verbum, the so called last gospel. The prologue of St. John. And that is the that is low mass according to the use of serum. And if any of you readers and viewers find that I have been mistaken in some of, in my interpretation of the rubrics and uh, other details, I would be very um, Happy to have some remarks and comments, and uh, it's all a learning curve. Uh, the uh, serum use has not been in uh, regular use since the mid 16th century. Since then, only an occasional use, and uh, there are not. Uh, there is. There are quite a lot of documents from the early 16th century. Well, thank you for your attention and hopefully uh, this might be of use to those priests who would like to venture out into using the use of serum. Thank you for your attention.